You're on a train. Not just any train. This one's moving at the speed of light. You lift a gun. Aim forward. Pull the trigger. So, what happens to the bullet? Does it shoot out, stay still, or tear through the fabric of reality? Let's chase the answer. One frame at a time. Imagine you're sitting inside a futuristic train. Sleek silent, and slicing through space at 299,792,458 meters per second. That's light speed, the universal speed limit. You pull out a regular gun, a 9mm pistol. Nothing fancy. You're inside the train, which is sealed off from the outside world. From your perspective, Everything feels normal. You can sip tea, walk around, and even fire a bullet. But physics is about to ruin your day. A 9mm bullet moves at around 1,200 feet per second. Not even a sneeze compared to light. Now you're wondering, if the train's already moving at light speed and you fire a bullet forward, does it go faster than light? The short answer? Number it can't. Because according to Einstein's special relativity, nothing with mass can exceed the speed of light. Ever. Not your bullet. Not your train. Not even a scream. Let's break it down simply. Imagine you're throwing a ball inside a car. If the car's moving at 50 miles per hour, and you throw the ball at 10 miles per hour, someone outside sees it going 60. That works until you approach light speed. Now, physics changes the rules. You can't just add 1,200 feet per second to light speed. Space and time won't allow it. Instead, the bullet still moves away from you inside the train. But to someone outside watching from the ground, that bullet's speed is still just under light speed. The closer you get to light speed, the more time slows down for you and the bullet gains mass. Try pushing it faster, and it resists, violently. Here's where things get weird. Inside the train, you see the bullet moving ahead, like normal, but from the outside. Time on the train is crawling. Your bullet seems to float forward in slow motion. To you, the laws of physics feel unchanged. To the outside world, you're frozen in time, trapped in a metal tube, trying to outrun causality. Here's the real mind-bender. What if your train was moving at exactly the speed of light? Well, then you wouldn't exist. Because anything with mass cannot reach the speed of light. The energy required becomes infinite. Your train? It would need more energy than the universe contains. Your bullet? would never leave the chamber. Your atoms would stretch infinitely. In other words, this whole thought experiment collapses under physics. The fastest man-made object ever. NASA's Parker Solar Probe, clocking in at about 430,000 miles per hour. That's just 0.064% the speed of light. To even dream of trains at near light speed, you'd need near zero mass materials, infinite energy, and probably a death wish. But the math still matters, because understanding bullets on light speed trains isn't about weapons. It's about understanding the limits of reality. So, if you ever find yourself on a train moving at the speed of light, and you try to fire a bullet, don't worry about where it goes. Worry about where you are. Because if you're really traveling at light speed, physics already left you behind.